So some of you already know this, but um, I know there's a lot of new subscribers that don't. So you go back to um, this video, How I Met Kurt Cobain, Chris Novoselic, Bonham Eldons, and this guy right here, Dylan Y, leaves this message and he says, if you still have a copy of that tape, please consider getting it digitized and uploading it online for the sake of sharing some Nirvana history. So instantly I was like, ah, you know, that's a good idea. I should upload. And I thought about it, I was like, well, Kurt gave me four tapes, so what if I uploaded all four? <laughs> and you guys, I had no fucking idea. Anyway, so I go, yeah, I want to do that. Thanks. And then I said, done. I just finished the video, and I will be uploading soon. Just gave, uh, just gave me, oh, sorry. Kurt gave me four tapes. I will upload them all. So I just done a video explaining that I'm going to upload four tapes, and that's, you can find that. And then goes on. Um, and then that's right. I mean, after I uploaded even a couple of them, it was like crazy. So now I said, "You're responsible for this mayhem." <laughs> what the hell? I never thought people would come to my page this quick. Um, and then it just goes. It just goes on. But, yeah, I mean, that's how the butterfly effect works, I guess you'd say, or whatever, you know. Um, I just started started this page just wanting to tell some old stories. I, I mean, it really was going to be a few. And then people became so interested, and then, of course, the, the, the tapes just, you know, I mean, there's probably a few hundred publications around the world that have picked up the story. Um, every week or so, I'll look and just see wh who else, you know, and it's like, I just think it's 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 mind-blowing how that works. Um, but ultimately, it's it's been cool, you know, I've met a lot of, I've met a lot of awesome people on here, made new friends, hopefully I meet, I've even met a couple people in person, Hopefully, I'll meet more people in person eventually. When it comes to making money, I made, uh, you know, like the first month, I made a couple hundred dollars. Second month, I made about a hundred and thirty. Third month, uh, it was about fifty. And this month, I'll probably make like forty dollars. So really, there's no money in this. I mean, for anybody that thinks I'm in this for the money, of course it's nice to get a little extra money, sure. Um, but that's you know the YouTube page. It's uh, uh, initially because there were so many people viewing the videos, you make a little bit. You know, you get paid based on views or whatever. So you know, like I had said before. You know, and this my YouTube is 12 years old or whatever, and for years I made about anywhere from five to ten dollars a month. You know, so to have, it, you know, this was a big surprise. It was like, wow, okay, it helps me pay my phone bill, electricity, so it's great. But uh, yeah, you, YouTube, there's definitely not much money in it unless you get a whole lot views uh, a lot you gotta get thousands to make any money off this um, anyway I wanted to share that with you guys um, so for you that care for new subscribers that's that's the guy go go tell go tell Dylan why hello he may have changed his um, you, YouTube name he's got the two-headed dog which is from uh, Melvin's uh, uh, I don't know. If, I think it's might be from an, an album. I don't remember. Anyway, <laughs> you think I probably should, huh? I don't. 
I know it's, uh, I'm pretty sure that is the Melvin's logo. All right. Thanks. Bye.